Now in this segment we'll understand the relation between the MR, AR and the price elasticity of demand. Since we are clear what is AR, what is MR, we'll be able to understand the relation between them. The relation between them is given by the formula MR equals to AR into E minus 1 by E where E is the price elasticity of demand. So in short we can say that marginal revenue equals to average revenue multiplied by elasticity that is the price elasticity of demand minus 1 by price elasticity of demand. Now we are given three cases where E equals to 1, E is greater than 1 and E is less than 1. In all the three cases the answer will change. In the first case MR will be equal to 0. In the second case MR will always be positive and in the third case MR will always be negative. We will see how. We know that MR equals to MR equals to AR into E minus 1 upon E. So when E is 0, this will be AR into 1 minus 1 upon 1, which will be AR into 0 because 1 minus 1 is 0, 0 divided by 1 will be 0. So AR into 0 will always give you the answer 0. So we have seen that when E is 1, your marginal revenue will always be 0. In the next case, let's take MR as 2 since 2 is greater than 1. So the answer would be AR 2 minus 1 upon 2. This will be AR into 1 by 2. So it will be the half of AR that is AR by 2. So since AR always will be positive, half of it will also be positive. Same can be seen if we take elasticity as negative. we will get the same result. So, we have seen that when E equals to 1, MR is 0. When E is greater than 1, MR is always positive. When E is less than 1, MR is always negative. Please remember these three properties between AR and MR. MR is 0 when elasticity is 0. MR is positive when elasticity is more than 1. MR is negative when elasticity is less than 1.